done this in like, like six years. Perfect timing, we're in quarantine, so I just thought I would yeah, do a makeup tutorial. Um, I've been posting some looks on my Instagram. My Instagram's at Taylor Pierce, I'll write it here. So yeah, I'm just gonna show you what I do. Um, go from there. So the first step I like to do is um, prime. I've already like moisturized and everything like that. I used Dermalogica and I just bought the Drunk Elephant um, skincare range. So I'm trying a bit of both. I only got like sample sizes because my skin's very sensitive and it's actually having a hissy fit. I'm contemplating whether to like try and like cut things out of my diet like dairy and stuff like that because I'm actually just over the pimples like I'm really over it. So I'm using the Dior, um, like what is this called? Backstage face body primer. This makes your skin feel so soft. Like every time I put something on my face, I go red as a pumpkin. Well, pumpkins aren't red tones, so. <laughs> For foundation, I'm gonna use the NARS in Punjab. Punjab. I think it's called. This is the um, Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation. I love doing my base. I just think, I don't know, it's just so, it's just so relaxing. It's like meditating to me. He's like, what is he doing? Wow, great timing. I'm so sorry about that noise. That is actually really irritating. I'm gonna use the Born This Way Multi Use Sculpting Concealer. I like to use this as a contour color. So I'm just gonna apply this like my cheekbones. Also I like to apply it underneath here. And I just like to use my sponge and just blend it in. So how is everyone going during quarantine? I'm actually not minding it. Um, I normally work in retail and yeah, it's just not the best job ever, but I mean, it pays the bills. But I, I actually felt like I needed this alone time. Like, I feel like the world's just so full on. Like, I felt like we needed to slow down a bit. I watched the movie, um, Contag Contagion. So it's just a movie about a virus kind of similar to COVID-19. Um, the same kind of rules applied in the movie and I was just like, this is actually really creepy. I'm like literally applying tart shape tape, um, light medium honey. I like to use this for like my dark circles and I like to go over with a um, lighter color over top. Blending it literally up. I, I've been liking on Instagram, you know those looks where you really highlight this area but keep this like contoured if you know what I mean. Like you want that really like sculpted like angular look. I'm going to set, um, set it with a translucent powder. I'm just using the Hourglass Veil um, powder. Um, so what I like to do is actually set it before I bake because I feel like it just goes crusty and just not <laughs> not fun at all. So I'm just gonna literally push this into my skin. Like push it really in. Um, have any of you guys um, downloaded TikTok? Because I'm actually obsessed. I used to love Vine when it came out. Like Vine was like my thing, I actually loved it. And then um, they got rid of it and I was just like, what the hell? I'm not a dancer though. I don't really like dancing, but I just like, I don't know, like the transformation makeup videos are like really, really, like really cool. What do they call it? Like the for you page goes in categories of like what you like and stuff like that. And I don't know why, but mine's like, mine's like on a witch side of TikTok and like people like hexing each other and like I don't know I just don't understand it it's all like witch language and like, why are people hexing each other like it's just a bit crazy you know I didn't even 
even know that was a thing. I knew that like voodoo and stuff is, but I wouldn't be playing with that stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna apply my Laura Messier powder just underneath my eyes and I like to go up, up here and like leave it like a straight line, if that makes sense. So during quarantine, I've noticed that like, I've been impulsively, impulse, I can't even talk, impulse buying stuff. Like I bought a type of mushroom last night, like a mushroom, like it's called um, lion's mane. So long story short, I was with my ex-partner, I'm currently single. Um, he wasn't a great sleeper. Anyway, I slept on, <laughs> I slept on my neck really bad. Like I've like broken a nerve in my neck. Like I was waking up every single day with a headache, but the headache would turn into a migraine. If you've ever had a migraine, it goes to like the back of your eyes, vision goes blurry. So this has been happening for, to me for, I would say like six months now. Like, so I went to the doctor and everything. I had tests and everything like that. My doctor was like, oh, you know, you know, you should just go get a massage and stuff like that. Or go see like a chiropractor and osteo osteopath. But then we ended up in quarantine and I tried to call all the like osteopaths and stuff like that. And they're all closed. So I had, I've had to wait. Anyway, I've been looking for like natural remedies to like help with ner your nervous system. And I come across this mushroom. And I seen the top comment was something like a someone said they came from like Joe Rogan's um, podcast. And anyway, I started watching this whole entire podcast about mushrooms. I love it so much. So um, yeah, I bought this like lion's mane mushroom in a like an oil. And I'm actually hoping it actually helps me because I'm a, <laughs> I've had enough. I'm just using the um, Too Faced Chocolate Sole. It smells like chocolate. If you've ever accidentally got some in your mouth, it tastes like chocolate. Like I wouldn't like lick it. What I like to use um, for this type of look, let me get it. My James Charles Morphe palette. I like to use this shade here. I don't know what it's called. I like to start actually in the inner corner. So where my nose contour starts, I like to go just around like that. Back and forth motions. Like so. I had Subway today. We just got a drive through. I was just a bit skeptical because I'm like, they're going to stuff up my order. They're going to forget something. I'm like a fanatic for pickles. I love pickles in everything. And one time they forgot my pickles and I live like, oh, I'm like 15 minutes out of town. I'm being so angry because I was just like, they forgot my freaking pickles. But lucky I had some backup in the, um, in the fridge. But I'm gonna use the KKW Mario palette and this, I literally just use those two palettes. I'm using this orange shade called Miami, this one here, and I'm just going to go over top what I just did. I have to get a flat brush to get this shade here, apply it in my inner corner and just a little bit like that. Easy. Do one wing off camera, brown in the KKW palette, just smoke it out and then I like to go over with a liquid liner, this one's Tattoo Liner by Kat Von D. Okay, so I'm gonna get my tattoo liner in with that brown again and just like blend over top, if you know what I mean. I just don't like it to look sharp. I like it to look a bit blended. So I'm gonna go back in with those shades, so this one and the one in KKW. And I'm just gonna blend this underneath my lash line. I'm so sorry. My mum loves to make noise. I do makeup on the weekends with clients and she always, 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 always has to be in the area where I'm doing makeup.
I love you. She's one of those moms that comes in and is like, what are you doing? Do you want to have a scotch with me? <laughs> nah, she's cool. I love my mom. In love with this. It's the Kevin O'Quan Volume Mascara. That's what it looks like. So I'm going to stick on some lashes. I'm using the Tati Lashes in TL9. I'm going to sweep this bake off. Fluffy brush. And I'm just going to literally no flashback here <laughs> so i'm gonna apply this blush it's new romance finished doing my eyebrows um i just gotta do one more thing with my eyebrows i like to use pear soap um and like a little spoolie i'm gonna just spray and it's kind of like gets your brow hairs nice and groomed i like to use the dior um glow face what is this the glitz one i like to use the gold shade and i like to mix it with the wet and wild highlight powder as well so i'm just gonna apply that sorry for the big love highlight i'm just gonna go off camera again <laughs> and um put my eye contacts in and then I'll come back. This is Wally. Wally, say hello. Say hello. Hi. This is Lillis. He's a Cancer. He was born in June. He's turning four this year. How is your needle? Needle in the bum. Hmm? My boy. Now, I like to use the KKW lip liner in 90s Icon. So what I like to do is I like to overdraw my cubist bow and also underneath my bottom lip. And then I like to go in with Honey Love by MAC. And then I like to go over top with... Um, He's a mixer by KKW. I'm just going to set my face. So, that's like, yeah, this is it. This is my go to makeup look for Instagram photos. Thank you for watching, everyone. Like, if you watch this entire video, like, thank you so much. If you want you can like this video and subscribe to my channel i'll try and upload as much as possible i think that is all i'm gonna go have another drink and yeah edit this video bye